Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth 204 for another episode of Let's Play We Love Captain Muddy. In the last episode, we made, well, we saw some story. Turns out the king had a pretty tough life. Now, uh, let's go to the Load Katamari Damashi Constellation data. Since I have that on this memory card. Um, is that the... Yeah, it's this one. So, that's not going to really affect much, it's just going to put stars in our sky. It's going to be in the cosmos screen. So yeah, it doesn't like, you know, automatically make you have any better of a game, really. <laughs> but it's nice that it goes from one game to the next here. I'm really sleepy, but I want to see a big cut tomorrow. Okay, so the background music for this board is going to be Kuru Kuru Rock. Hey, King Dude. You're so cool and relaxed, lounging around as usual. I love Katamari Damashi. I love how mellow it is. So I'm copying Katamari Damashi and lounging around. Oh, now I'm falling asleep, but before I do... I want to see a real Katamari. Yeah, sure. Fly, fly, pizza pie. <laughs> oh, we were asleep. Were our eyes open? Oh, Prince, what? What? He wants to see a Katamari before he goes to bed? What? Are you serious? No, this is Katamari Damashi. We are not that easy. We work hard at rolling, you know. He works hard for the rolling. Hard for the rolling. No, no, not possible. Could not be done. No, your highness is the best. The best. No, not impossible. Not at all. Yes, you are very right. Are very and absolutely right. If anything, we shouldn't play except just before bed. Yes. All aboard, let's make a Katamari. Shut up, phone. I uh, hope you guys can hear that. Yeah, Amor. Oh, th I think this is the name of names of the cousins, maybe? I don't know. What are these cats doing? So sleepy after all. <sighs> let's roll here. It's a room again, but it's just work. Let's just work on getting it big. If you make it bigger, you can roll it in lots of other places. Mm, let's see. How about this much time to make this big a Katamari? If you can manage, that would be nice. Alright, Prince, it's all yours now. Oh, this is one of the weird tracks. Okay. It's like, I don't know, Japanese punk rock or something? Not really, because it's not screaming, but... Oh, Japan. Unlike uh, the other game, I actually haven't really memorized most of the music in this game. So, I can't really sing along, but maybe some of you are happy about that. <laughs> Got some dress pins. Got them ready. Okay, let's get off the table. Uh, let's see what do we got over here. Yeah, we got a key. You got the key, got the key, got the wonderful key. Okay, and... Okay, now we're down here. Uh, what do we got, what do we got? We got this stuff. I like how they, like, you know, put a lot of regular sized objects on these areas so that you can, um... You know, even if you go off the table early, you can still build up your Katamari even if it's a bit slower. You know, it's, it's not entirely unforgiving in that aspect. Oh, awesome, now we can get this stuff. So yeah, I, I do love the way that this game, I've said it so many times, but I love the way this game has like exponential growth. Like you start off the, all the boards, you start off just going really slow, you know, building things up. And then as you get bigger and bigger, you're, you just start like super, super growth. Oh wow, I got the chopsticks, nice. Didn't think I was big enough for that. It's a living dead fish. It's a zombie fish. We're getting away from that. Oh, look at the cute little tadpoles. Are these thermometers? They're thermometers. Let's hope they're not rectal thermometers because th that would be creepy. Little par party popper over there. Let's get these magnets. How does it work? Yeah, so this board introduces a new area to get to once you're a certain size. It's nice that it also has like gradients like that. You know, like you can only go to the bigger area once you're like capable. It's not. It doesn't just like 
let you make a mistake there. Oh, wow, there's a whole world under the table here. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. Shrimp. That's creepy. At least this isn't like, uh, what was the game? Monster House? Or something like that? Where, um... Uh, you have to fight, uh, Tempura Shrimp? Cause that's, that's just creepy. Sup, cats? I don't think we can get big enough to roll up the cats. Excuse me. Can't speak! Ah, finally we can talk. We have a little trouble loading. You can't talk during loading, you know. Really? We finally have our own voice back. Start loading. Okay. Yeah. We're just a sleepy head. Thank you. Uh, yeah, so whenever you get to the, uh, the mark where you can move onward in the board, uh, can can. Ew, get it away from me. It looks like Tingle. Uh, whenever you get to the part, uh, like the, the size where you can finally move on, the game will let you know. Which is also nice. Stop getting in the way! Got, okay, this is like a food board. We got like, you know, fried uh, tempura. We got those, the fried squid there. I wonder where the cats went. But yeah, uh, you know what? Let's go outside. You can also pick up the barrier, which is nice. Meow. Hello, cats. Cats? I'm a kitty cat. Cat. Da -da 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 cats? I'm a kitty cat. Cat. Okay. So yeah, let's go out into the yard. Whee! Look at the Pokemans. You see what I did there? It's called a non sequit. You know why I said Pokemon? Because I was thinking, when I said go out into the yard, I was thinking of the game Pokemon Channel. And, um, well, there's an option. Like, you can go into the yard there. If you've never played Pokemon Channel, it's going to be really hard to explain, but just trust me when I say go into the yard is, is something that you do a lot. <laughs> Thanks, Dovey. Thanks for confusing the heck out of us. Yes, yeah, so we still have uh, two, maybe minute and a half left. Uh, I, we're definitely gonna make this. Hello, cat! Cat. K-A-T. Oh, look at all the food! So yummy! Yummy in my tummy! Okay. 37, 38... No, I want to eat the birds! Yeah, so we're, we have about a minute left or so. See what the thing in the upper right corner says, and we made it. Ooh, start picking up these things now. Birds, what you, what you, what you do? You can't play that. You can't play instruments, birds. That's silly. Okay, rabbits. No, rabbits is my carrot now. My carrot. No, can't pick it up. Oh, sadness. 53. Okay, so we have less than a minute now. Pick up some soy sauce. I'm sorry. No, these aren't soy sauces. Those are like orange juice or something. Yeah, video cassettes. And you're like, what the heck is a video cassette, Dovey? Because <laughs> because they don't really use those today. I don't know how it is in Japan. I would assume they don't really use video cassettes in Japan either. But I I got all the birds this time. Uh, I really can't say what they do, do or don't use in Japan, but yeah, you see how much there is to do in this board that I have not unlocked? I just picked up a chalk. Hello, Basilisk Lizard! Can I eat you? No, I can't. Okay. This game is bananas. See that banana bunch right there? Uh, yawnies! It's finally over, really. Too sleepy. So, so nice that the Katamari's done. Let's go home. So, Katamari. Much picking up. Right, sleeping again? Ah, uh, we fill I S L E E P with our eyes open. Oh, there's a Katamari here come out of nowhere. Okay, sorry. We were surprised at first, but it comes in a little short. Really, it's 55 centimeters. You could have made it a bit larger, yes? You made it. Could have made it more grande, yes? Hurry up and make the bestest Katamari ever. Well, excuse me, Mister. 
Oh my god, his head is spinning. What the heck? Oh, it's second cousin Ken Ken. What are you doing on Earth? Circling the table? We have no idea what you're talking about. This feels. This cut of mine feels necessities ish. Not that necessities ish sounds very nice. I'm still sleepy, I'm kinda still dreaming. Probably because the Katamari's so small. You can have this one, dude. I changed his voice. Oh really? You're giving it to us? Yeah, he says the same thing. Oh, let's put it up in the cosmos. Blah, 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 blah. And we get a usual stuff, Neptune. <laughs> oh, it's a star now. It's a planet, you fool. Awesome dude, I just wanted to travel the universe in my dreams. Yeah. Uh, ten minutes. I think we could do one more board. Oh, chapter two, Claws of a Tiger. It's the Claws of a Tiger. It's the oh, snap. You can do the king. I'm rooting for you, man. Oh, snap. K.O. T.K.O. Oh, uh, what? Rabbit? What? Why is it trophy a carrot? Second place. I love how his arm is just in the middle of nowhere. You're no son of mine. No! <gasps> oh. Oh. It's like that, that meme, the, um, the Asian dead. You know, like the, the, like... I don't know. Whatever. But yeah, so the king seems to... Well, hello. The king seems to have had a really rough childhood. His father only... You're huge! Nice to meet you! Yeah, I'm like up to your knees and I'm huge. Uh, let's change the bag. We got Houston Random, Katamari and the Rock Arrangement, Katamari and the Swing. Uh, let's go to Katamari and the Rock's Arrangement. My dream is to be gold medalist. Is he a practice? Let's, okay, so we're going to be rolling underwater. Oh, yummy fresh air. Look at the majesty of nature. We prefer the mountains to the beach. What about you, Prince? Hmm? Water? Underwater? Not the mountains or the beach? Well, there goes our vacation buzz. Cut to my dabba shoes. Great. It takes gold medal. Gold medal. Medal. No, you're right, nothing can happen without water. The beach has water. The oceans, the mountains, we owe our existence, we all owe our existence to water. Come, come, let's go rolling underwater. Sleep, sleep, sleepity, sleepity, wee, wee, boing. Yeah. Underwater, wow, this is an amazing place. Oh, you can breathe, Prince? Snorkel, of course. That's not how snorkels work. Forgot about the Katamari. This much time. This much, this big Katamari. Ooh, 80 centimeters, okay. It's got triangle shell, okay. So yeah, so we have the same amount of time as last time, but we have to be quite a bit bigger. I believe we can make it though. Also, see all these like hooks with lures? This is what I have, uh, you know, don't, I know, I'm not gonna demonstrate. If you touch it, you get reeled in, and it doesn't do anything, it just wastes time. You get stuck for a few sec, for a few seconds, so, uh, I wouldn't do it. Also, these guys are just, like, this dog and cat here. Like, what, what is even... I really don't know, this game doesn't know how snorkels work. Like, you, the snorkel is a good way to, to breathe air when you're just a little bit under the surface, but if the snorkel can't actually draw air in, all the, this is also dried squid, it's kind of funny. If the snorkel can't, that, 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 that's, a, that's a herd of tempura shrimp right there. Uh, if the snorkel can't draw air in, it doesn't really, doesn't really help now, does it? And we were just headbutted by a turtle. How many games can you play where you can say, I was just headbutted by a turtle? Also, what is this guy doing, singing? <laughs> yeah, I'm sad that it doesn't have the uh, or like original na 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 catch a Yeah, we real did. You want to be released too? Come on. I think you just have to shake yourself off. 
Also, it's cool. Like as you get bigger, you can see like what kind of fish and stuff and other aquatic creature. Ah, I took the bait without it. And these things, uh, honey was. They're creepy. They're creepy, creepy things. Also, um, uh, look at that tuna. I think it's a tuna. Um, you just have to be careful. Like you know the. It's nice, it, it doesn't treat the underwater as just like another area, it gives it its own set of physics, so you know, it's harder to stop, uh, you, you know, you, you can float a bit, so it, uh, you know, it, it makes it a bit more challenging, which is nice. Look at that cat with the snorkel just scoping out little fish there. Okay. Waste of time. Hey, anyway, it's a mermaid, okay. I just want to listen to this guy, he's ridiculous. Goldfish in a bag in the... Uh, goldfish in a bag inside of the, uh... Okay, come on. Inside of, like, a little lake. You can get most of these fish. Which is pretty cool, actually. You don't need a snorkel! Hey, cat. No, no. I like the ray too. Ooh, I got the catfish though, sticking to it. Even though it should be like a remora or something, really. Dude, you can actually go uh, above the water, but there's really not... I don't know, there's not really much of a point. There's some stuff lining the edges, I guess I'll show you. But, uh, it doesn't, uh... Yeah, look at that. It's much big. Oh yeah, treasure. Oh, cool, coins. Um, so yeah, I guess you travel up as you get a bit bigger. Yeah, squid. So what is this? India ink. Oh, I got the octopus, wow. That's cool. Also, if you notice, like, as you roll, um, you know, it consolidates the stuff into, like, a bit bigger of a, uh, uh like a more circle shape, you know, if you have something that's on the edge or whatever. See, these people have air tanks. Wow, I got crabs here, king crabs, jellyfish. A cat that's fishing underwater. Oh, we picked up the cat, yes. Okay, let's turn around. We're heading back down into the, uh, into the middle area here. We're gonna start picking up... Oh yeah, and there's over here. Also, you visit, uh, his penguins watching TV. Uh, it's, the TV is always you, by the way. It always, like, follows you, which is kind of cool. Um, sorry, cat. Oh, I can't pick him up yet, but I took your mask. Um, what was I saying? I was saying something. I don't know. But yeah, so now, see, now it's exponential. Uh, yeah, so I was saying before, uh, you visit each board a few times, uh, as far as I know. Uh, at different sizes with different objectives, so you know, it's always fun to uh, see the board from a different perspective, and uh, you roll up things you previously couldn't. Let's go along the edge and just pick up everything over here. Uh, let's go to that thing in the middle. Okay, so we only have a few seconds left. So let's try to roll up onto the lands now. Yeah. Yeah, you know, the board is uh, self-contained, so it's it's not like you can you just all of a sudden. Oh, we got the people! Ha ha! You know, you can't just suddenly start. Can we get you? We can't get you yet. Let's get the penguins. We got the TV. Got these things. Oh yes! Ha ha ha! Yes, 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 yes! Roll everything! That was beautiful! Yes, yeah, so we're supposed to get 80 centimeters. We got more than double that. <laughs> yes, go, go, go home. Um, so yeah. This is fun. Yeah, so it's nice to say, like, each board is self contained, but you visit it a few times at different sizes or for different objectives, so it's just nice to see. Also, like, in the later boards, like, you can see, you can actually, like, visit all these areas, you know, in giant form. If you play Katamari Damashi, you know that you get really big. You end up, like, 
burble, 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 flap. It's fun to swim. Um, so you get to, uh, uh, like, see all the areas. It's all part of the same world. So, like, you get to roll up, roll them up as a much bigger entity, so it's cool. It's not big. What? I mean, a huge, dude. Soaking wet Katamari is very aquarium-ish. Also a bit snacksy and somewhat playground-ish. It's kind of damp. Oh, really? I know it's underwater and everything, but still. Can't you be more clear by making it fit? Shut your face! They never judgmental everybody. <laughs> yes, was so pleased. And I didn't find the cousin that time. Sadness. Mercury. Oh, don't tap the glass mercury. Okay, it's the age of Aquarius. It's pretty cool. It is a nice, that is a pretty cool planet, actually. And that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. In the next episode, we'll continue onward. It's been Stuff for All Level 4 with We Love Katamari. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.